Welcome. Welcome to ABS WebTech stand to see the introduction of a world first in submersible sewage pumps. And welcome you following the conference on the web. I am Pietro Oro, President and CEO of Cardo and ABS. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a great day for ABS and for the wastewater industry. Today is the culmination of years of hard work in launching our new ABS FX range. A totally new concept in submersible sewage pumps to satisfy the new demands of the wastewater industry. Our new ABS FX range is totally unique. The development team has gone back to, to first principles and designed the new range, taking into consideration both changes that they have taken place the past, past years in the wastewater industry and society, as well as future requirements from environmental pressures and new legislations. As regards environmental care, the ABS FX range is the world's first submersible with built-in premium efficiency motors to reduce energy consumption and CO2 emissions in order to help combat climate change. Within the next few years, the use of higher efficiency motors for pumps will become mandatory within the US, European Union, and other number of countries worldwide. In addition to the environmental benefits, the premium efficiency motors saves energy and thereby reduces operational costs. Other higher performance benefits of our ABS FS range that will help cons customers become more competitive include long-term reliability, excellent rag handling, and future-proof design. I would personally like to thank all of those involved with their research, development, manufacture and marketing of this exciting new range of, of uh, submersible sewage pumps that is on show today. Last but not least, I'd like to thank all personnel of ABS USA for doing a great job in organizing our outstanding presentation at WEFTEC. Now I hand over to Mark Reddit, head of ABS Global Marketing Products Management, who will give you a deeper <coughs> insight into excellent features of the ABS FX range. Please enjoy the show. Mark Reddit. Good morning. Welcome again to the stand. Um, what I'd like to do is we're just going to spend uh, roughly 20 minutes and we're just going to take you through the process in terms of the process that we've used in terms of uh, designing this product and we're also going to give you a little bit more detail in terms of some of the features. One thing that you will hear a lot of in this 20 minutes is talk of future-proof. You will also hear talk of us raising the standard. ABS is setting a new standard today. It is setting a new standard for submersible pumps. Okay, and we believe that that standard is the way forward, as Peter said, in terms of protecting the environment and also giving our customers what they need in terms of economical operation. 
just as a start, I would just like to talk through the process that we've used. We've actually gone through five very key steps in terms of developing this product. The first of those steps is that we have gone back to basic principles and we have looked at our market drivers. For us, if we want this product to be future-proof, we have to understand where the market's going. We have to understand what is going to influence the way that you do your business, not today, but over the next three, four, five years. If we want this product to be the right product for you in the long term, we have to understand the market. What we have also done is that we have now done a, a very uh, detailed market investigation. That market investigation is by talking to our key customers, it's by talking to our sales companies to get a better understanding in terms of what we think the market requires. We have then taken this information and then we've benchmarked our products. We've looked at our products and we said, how good are we at actually delivering these features? We have done a lot of work to make sure that we understand how good our products are. What we have then done is we have taken the information in terms of market requirements and again we've come back to our reference groups and we've tested to make sure what we are going to design is right for the market. And finally from that we have created a specification which we've designed the product to. I'd like to just talk very briefly about market drivers. Because if we talk about the wastewater market at the moment, it is a changing market. If we go back five years and we look at products that we were designing five years ago, that is very, very different today. There are a number of things that are very, very heavily influencing the way that we work. We can talk about legislation. We can talk about pressure on reducing CO2. We can talk about increasing energy costs. We can talk about reducing water consumption. We can talk about the change in the way that we manufacture sanitary items. If we talk about a product that was designed 10 years ago, it is not the best product to be using today. 